Hey all, this is John Lemazny and I'm here to talk to you about one of the posts on lemazny.com that is 10 recent answers to what should I do with my life. I have a lot of experience talking with students and students often come to me in sidebars after class and they say, what should I be doing? What, what am I trying to accomplish here? These are 10 answers that I tend to respond with and I hope that they give you some benefit in your conversations with others who may be looking to you for guidance. Number one, pursue what you love and have passion for. Uh, passion is something that is self-divined. It's something where you come across something and you have an excitement for it. You may be influenced by others, but it's yours. Uh, go and do work in that because that will help you to excite others about what uh, their personal passions are. Collect experiences, not stuff. I've seen enough people get uh, drowned in their own personal junk including my mother and my sisters, it's horrible. Uh, you should escape that and try to collect experiences. Even if you spend money, regardless of whether you spend money, spend time at parks, spend time in uh, national parks, spend time driving, looking at things, experiencing things. Look to your ideological mentors, leaders, and heroes for answers. By all means, go and talk uh, ideologically to Martin Luther King Jr or go and speak with uh, Noam Chomsky, as I have. I sent him an email and he responded, and it was one of the greatest moments of my life that I'm only sharing here. Uh, have conversations with those who you respect and try to have an understanding of their response. Uh, resist convenience and high technology when or where it removes your independence, by all means. If you are not independent because of your reliance on Facebook, get rid of it. Learn to meditate and be mindful. Learn to count to four again and again for 15 minutes and just understand that there is a process in uh, counting and counting and counting again. Imagine the public memory of your deceased self. Consider that you have a legacy and you define it. Remove illusions and seek truths by all means. Go and find out what has happened in this country and why you are affected by those decisions. Recognize and beware addictions and vices. Stay away from things that demand your attention. Realize the earth is an only uh, uh, solution for life, a sustainable resource that if we slow down our consumption and plan sensible resource management, we can live and eat less and move more. Try to live. That's my statement for today. Thank you so much for YouTube uh, putting up this great feature for me to be able to put up a quick video. And I think three minutes is the limit. And here we go. Three, two, one. No, maybe not. We get the three minutes. Well, uh, go ahead and look at the post. And I hope that you also check out the biblio and videography. And I hope that you live better as a result of this post. Thanks to YouTube again for the great feature. See you all later.